There we go. <laughs> Alright, so watch this. Scooby and who do you got? Yes. Oh, one more. Come on in. <laughs> Beautiful. All right. Everybody's quiet enough. So again, welcome and thanks for braving the rain. And you gotta follow mom. Follow mom. Good. So we gather here to give thanks for all the pets that we have in our lives and all the animals that we care for and give us company and joy and excitement and wonder. And we gather together to give thanks for them and to say a little blessing to them so that they continue to grow and bring us joy and happiness. So I'm going to read a short reading as best I can over the noise. <laughs> and then we'll do our animal blessing. Noise? It's a little bit of noise here, Dorothy. <laughs> so our reading is going to be for Matthew. Jesus told them, therefore I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat or what you will drink, or about your body, what you will wear. Is not life more than food and the body more than clothing? Look at the birds of the air. They neither sow nor reap and gather into barns, yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not of more value than them? And what can, and what can you, by worrying, add any time to your lifespan? And why do you worry about clothing? Consider the animals and lilies of the field, how they grow. They neither toil nor spin, yet I tell you, even Solomon in all his glory was not clothed like these. But if God so cares for the grass of the fields, which is alive to them today and gone tomorrow, will he not so much more clothe you? Therefore do not worry, saying, what will we eat, or what will we drink, or what will we wear? For it is the Gentiles who strive for all these things. And indeed, God knows all that you need, and God will provide you with them. If strive first for the kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you. So let's say a, a short prayer. Good and gracious God, we thank you for all of the animals in the world, for all of your creation, for dogs and cats and cows and sheep and all the animals that bring us joy and help sustain us in our world. May they be healthy and strong and filled with joy, sustaining and doing all that they can to make lives better for us and bring us happiness. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless me and watch over you and cares me very much. It's cool. Aww. Aww. Gabby and Muppet. Gabby, remember that God loves you very much and so do we. And we ask that you have a healthy, happy life. This is good. This is good. No, this one's good. This is good. Muppet. Muppet. This is good. Okay. Muppet, we love you very much and we're glad that you're part of our lives. And we ask that God bless you. All right, one more. And who's our friend here? Tony. All right, Tony, we're very happy that you're part of our lives and that you're here with us. And we give thanks to God for you. Amen. Amen. Oh, where are you? Oh, phone cat. Who's got yes, phone cat? Phone, oh, yeah, phone hamster. <laughs> All right, you got your phone hamster? Yeah. Well, Jen, I could do our cat when we go home. Well, this is TV Baby from the backyard. Oh, Jen. <laughs> I have a All right, who's that? Lily. Lily, we bless you and we thank God for you. and We're happy that you're here with us. Oh, oh they don't want that one. All right, phone cat. All right, so let's, oh, let's see. Weenie. Weenie. Well, we give thanks for you and we're glad that you're here with us. You want a family photo? Oh, sure, thank you. Probably not with bombs. Come on, we don't want to see, we don't want to see puppy butt. All right, look at me. Good boys, there we go. That may be as good as we can get. Thank you.